characters, plot, setting, theme, conflict. These are the five things. All right, setting is one of the five elements of a narrative, and we are going to study that one. Eventually, we will get through all and learn about all character, plot, setting, theme, conflict. These are the five things. So setting, what is it? How does it impact a story or a scene? We're just going to go over the basics here. In a future lessons, we will analyze word choice, how we change setting, and eventually create our own setting. Three elements of a setting. Time. When it's happening. Place. Where it's happening. Now many of us know these two elements. But when you put those two together, it creates what we call the atmosphere. Now this is not the atmosphere that you would learn about in science. We'll go over atmosphere in a minute. Now you can remember this using mnemonic devices. Time, place, atmosphere. Pat. Place, atmosphere, time. Pat's king of steaks. When, you know, think setting. What's the setting of the cheesesteak place? Ah, yes. That looks like it's the daytime. It looks like... Oh, uh, we're going to go with the city. Now, we know it's South Philly. Hopefully. And the atmosphere. There's not much going on in that picture. So I'd say maybe kind of... Eh, just a normal, ordinary day. Not too exciting. But anyway, let's move on. Tap, you can remember it this way. Tap, T-A-P, time, atmosphere, place. Make you tap out like John Cena. You can't see me. Yes, I may be the only language arts teacher in America who admits to watching professional wrestling. Or you can tap dance. It's the old king of tap dance, Fred Astaire. All right, time. This is, it can be general, it can be specific. So general would be past, present, future. It could be a season such as summer, spring, and fall. Specific, the actual date, September 18th, 2015, at 9, 10 a.m. That would be specific, but it could also be general. Place, where the action is happening. This could include a city or town, Collingswood, New Jersey. A country, Istanbul, a building, Collinswood Middle School, a room, 203, a restaurant, the pop shop, certain place outdoors, ah, the beach on Wildwood Crest, ooh, section 203 of Lincoln Financial Field on Sunday afternoon as the Eagles demolished those Dallas Cowboys. How about them Cowboys? All right, atmosphere. So now we have time, we have place. Let me give you an equation. Yes, you can tell your math teachers we are learning equations here. Time plus place equals atmosphere. T, time, plus the place, ooh, we're going to Walt Disney World, equals the atmosphere. And, well, I said this isn't the same atmosphere as science. I figure a picture like that we remember. So T plus P equals A. T plus P equals A. Time, place, atmosphere. Time, place, atmosphere. Time, place, atmosphere. Atmosphere is the mood created by time and place. If you change one, if you change the time, you change the atmosphere. For example, you'll have a certain atmosphere at 9 a.m. on a Monday morning in school. But if I just change one, we'll still have 9 a.m. Monday morning, but let's change it to Great Adventure. Does the atmosphere change? And really, that is all there is to setting. Time, place, atmosphere.